Back here in Mid Missouri, a Jefferson City long term care facility was hit with a wrongful death lawsuit today by a family who lost a loved one due to COVID 19. ABC 17's Zach Boetto took a look at the lawsuit and joined us live from our newsroom tonight. Zach, the documents allege that JC Manor did not take the right steps to keep the virus out of the facility. Yeah, Deb, this lawsuit right here says the family feels J.C. Manor is responsible for their father's death because a nurse told them that an employee who was positive with the virus brought it into the building, leading to their father's positive case and resulting in his death. David Oosley passed away on October 4th last year after a two-month battle with COVID-19. His family, now suing J.C. Manor, the long-term care facility where he lived, claiming if he wouldn't have been exposed to the virus in the facility, he would not have died. The lawsuit claims a J.C. Manor nurse told the family within the first week Oosley caught COVID as a direct consequence of his spread within the premises by an employee who caught it from outside the facility. On August 21st of last year, 52 residents and 35 workers had tested positive and three residents had already died. The family now saying J.C. Manor did not provide care, skill and practice, failed to formulate a plan to keep sick employees out, failed to put together a plan for a sterile environment and failed to provide adequate staff. The family now wanting damages for the loss of their father and funeral, burial and other expenses. And Deb, I reached out to the Oosley family this afternoon. They declined to comment. I also reached out to J.C. Manor, but have not yet heard back. Reporting live from the newsroom, Zach Bawetto, ABC 17 News. Zach, thank you. And this all comes as a new COVID-19 liability shield for businesses will go into effect tomorrow.